Hello, my name's Darren Jenkins and I'm Noah's daddy. I work for Marshall Aerospace and Defence and I make sure that our apprentices and managers have all the learning and skills and training they need to be able to do their job effectively. Today I'm going to be reading chapter 18 from Ronald Dahl's The Twits. And the chapter 18 is The Roly Poly Bird to the Rescue. I do hope you enjoy this. Mugglewomp and his family longed to escape from the cage in Mr. Twit's garden and go back to the African jungle where they came from. They hated Mr. and Mrs. Twit for making their lives so miserable. They also hated them for what they did to the birds every Tuesday and Wednesday. Fly away birds, they used to shout, jumping about in the cage and waving their arms. Don't sit on that big dead tree, it's just been smeared all over with sticky glue. Go and sit somewhere else. But these were English birds and they couldn't understand the weird African language the monkeys spoke. So they took no notice and went on using the big dead tree and getting caught for Mrs Twit's bird pie. Then one day a truly magnificent bird flew down out of the sky and landed on the monkey cage. And can you see? Look at this big beautiful bird. Good heavens, cried all the monkeys together. It's the roly-poly bird. What on earth are you doing over here in England, roly-poly bird? Like the monkeys, the roly-poly bird came from Africa and he spoke the same language as they did. I've come for a holiday, said the roly-poly bird. I like to travel. He fluffed his marvellous coloured feathers and looked down rather grandly at the monkeys. For most people, he went on, flying around on holiday is very expensive, but I can fly anywhere in the world for free. Do you know how to talk to these English birds? Mugglewomp asked him. Of course I do, said the roly-poly bird. It's no good going to a country and not knowing the language. Then we must hurry, said Mugglewomp. Today is Tuesday and over there you can already see the revolting Mr Twit up the ladder painting sticky glue on all the branches of the big dead tree. This evening, when the birds come in to roost, you must warn them not to perch on that tree or they will be made into bird pie. That evening, the roly-poly bird flew round and around the big dead tree, singing out, there's sticky stick stuff all over the tree. If you land in the branches, you'll never get free. So fly away, fly away, stay up high, or you'll finish up tomorrow in a hot bird pie. I hope you enjoyed that.